Hello everyone. From the last three videos, we are talking about theoretical aspect of motivation, right? And as I have told previously, that there are five theories explaining the employee motivation. The first of which was Maslow's hierarchy of needs, right? That we have already talked about. Now comes the turn of second theory, which is Herzberg two-factor theory. So we are going to talk about it today. Well, Frederick Herzberg, he basically tried to explain the employee motivation on the basis of two factors, right? That is why it is called two-factor theory. Now, what are these two factors? He tried to explain that there are basically motivators and hygiene factors on the basis of which you can retain your employees. Well, Herzberg has explained these two factors with the help of two arrows, one in the upward direction and one in the downwards direction. So first of all, the upward arrow, it basically tries to show those motivators that actually pushes your employee into performing better. And the downward arrow basically tries to show that in the absence of these factors, your employees may get dissatisfied. Now, before going forward, first understand that why are these arrows are taken upwards and why the hygiene factor arrow is taken downwards. Just imagine a line, right? A line of neutralness. So if a person is your employee, it means that he has some kind of satisfaction or some kind of motivation to stay in your organization, right? So this line is of neutralness of that employee's satisfaction and motivation. Now, with the help of motivators, you can enhance the motivation of your employees, right? But in the absence of these motivators, your employee will not get demotivated. If there are not these motivators, the motivation of your employees comes to the neutral state. But in the absence of your hygiene factors, if the hygiene factors are missing from your organization, it may bring dissatisfaction. That is why these arrows are shown in a upward and a downward direction. Now moving forward, let's understand what are the motivators. 